Hi everyone, this is a to be continued. So I've just put the false eyelashes on um, instead of trying to battle with eyeliner because it's so freaking hard. And I'm just going to put on a little bit of blush and a bit of eyeshadow and then we should be set to go out. Well, out to the other room. <laughs> Not really. No, I do have to have, do some filming. So I thought we'll try and, um, we'll try and uh, make a little bit of an effort. So I'm just putting on some blush. Oh, you know what I did forget? Uh, I keep forgetting about this. It's the two... Um, touche de clat or whatever from Yves Saint Laurent. Uh, you pump the end like this and you just put, oh, this is, I've got one that's really full and one that's really, oh no, there we go. And you just put that on your um, bits that need a bit of a uh, cover up and highlight, which is there. And I get my brush that I use just for that. I think it's that one, let's hope. And I just pretend I'm painting some kind of masterpiece, you know. I might even put some on my eyelid because they're a bit dark in the crease and I'm going to put eyeshadow on it. Now I know that looks really dodgy, but don't worry, it'll be fine. Then I use my fingers to blend it in because I am no brush artist. Then other side, just to get that purpley tone out. But I think I'm getting better at this. If you watch my first video, like I honestly didn't have a clue and I still haven't really, but I think, I think with makeup, it's a case of practice makes perfect. So you may as well be practicing with me and let's get better at it together because uh, as we age, we need more stuff. So, and I just never really bothered with makeup much before because I wore it for dancing and, uh, and then for real life, I couldn't be bothered. I'm really lazy. So, uh, okay, so that's our concealer kind of thing. Um, yeah, no, that's all right. I was going to do the mouth cracks, and I thought I can't be bothered. Um, <laughs> just drop something. Um, this is a young blood one. I love it. Palette. I've used it before. Um, so I just use a tapered brush, which takes all the work out for me, uh, the guesswork out, I should say. I'm going to use this sort of rusty colour. Use whatever colour that's just a bit darker than your than your uh, skin. We don't want to be too. We don't. We don't I'm not going for the. Uh, um, nightclub look I'm just going for the I'm gonna do a little bit of a video with a friend and uh, she's like 10 years younger than me or maybe more 15 years younger than me um so yeah I've got to try and look half decent and I just realized that a foundation I used earlier that I said sprays when you or across the room when you use it is actually on the light just up there just make some talk amongst yourselves just get a bit of my uh, oh god it's wet everywhere just wipe the lights down eh. Um, yeah, that's that. So we've got a bit of this eyeshadow on. How's that looking? Uh, just a little bit more in the corner there. I like warm colours. Um, I, I actually wore grey eyeshadow when I got married. Um, I'm not married now, but when I did. And I'd never worn grey before, but the makeup artist put it on me. And I realised later on it looks shit house. And uh, I've never worn it since. And any time anyone's gone to do my makeup, I've said warm, warm, warm. Unless it's a, unless it's a black smoky eye. But warm, grey just looked... I looked like a stranger anyway so here's so that's that I think that looks all right and I haven't got my glasses on so probably um, it probably could be better but uh, in my blurry 56 nearly 57 year old vision I'm looking all right um, what else I don't know a bit of lips maybe oh some earrings and lips and then we're done I think so lips I got this the other day it's a um what is it oh I can't even read it Oh, it's Maybelline, and it's like a, uh, a really painty um, lip gloss. Uh, it's called Matte Ink. So I put that on first, because I really uh, wear off my lipstick because I just talk all the time. I'm going to put that on, and then I put a lippy on top. Now, I'm going to do a, a little video about um, Botox and fillers for uh, gals our age. Um, so to tell you what I do, what I don't do, what I should do, probably what I shouldn't do, um, but what I do to kind of make myself feel okay. Um, so there's some lips and I'll let them dry. And I'll just put on a bit more blush while I'm doing that because I, I just like putting it on because it smells nice. So let's see. It's more of a bronzer really. I don't bother with all that contouring stuff that's like... I just can't be bothered, to be honest. Just don't want to look uh, uh, washed out or 
that's that. And oh, it smells beautiful. Um, that's that. Uh, earrings and then done. So here's the. Yeah, I don't know. What do you think? 56, 57 next week. We can all we can all get through it. Um, so subscribe and uh, follow some of the things I do. Laugh at some of the things I do, and uh, tell me some of the things I do are absolutely stupid and you shouldn't be doing them. Um, I don't care. Let's all have fun together. See you. Bye.